I am grateful for your visit. I hope you and family are keeping well. Will you please subscribe? The American Oyster Catcher, occasionally called the American Pied Oyster Catcher, is a member of family Hematopodidae. The bird is marked by its black and white body and a long, thick orange beak. It has distinctive black and white plumage and a long, bright orange beak. The head and breast are black and the back, wings and tail grayish black. The underparts are white, as are feathers on the inner part of the wing which become visible during flight. The irises are yellow, and the eyes have orange orbital rings. The legs are pink. It is found on the Atlantic coast of North America, from New England to Northern Florida, where it is also found on the Gulf Coast, the Caribbean, and south to Brazil, Uruguay, and Argentina. It is found also in the Pacific coast of California, Mexico, Central America, Peru, and Chile. During the breeding season, these birds are found along the Atlantic and Gulf coasts, and from Massachusetts south to Argentina, and Chile. In winter, they are found in flocks along the coast from central New Jersey to the Gulf of Mexico. They are closely tied to coastal habitats. They nest on beaches on coastal islands and feed on marine invertebrates. The large, heavy beak is used to pry open bivalve mollusks. Oyster catchers raise a clutch of two or three eggs. It feeds almost exclusively on shellfish and other marine invertebrates. Oysters are a staple of their diet, as their name suggests, but they also eat mussels, clams, limpets, sea urchins, starfish, crabs, and worms. In general, they use their bills to catch shellfish. As they walk across a shellfish bed, they look for a mollusk with a partially open shell. When they find one, they jab their bill into the shell and sever the muscle that causes the shell to clamp shut. This can be dangerous, however, as they are sometimes drowned when they don't completely sever this muscle and the shell clamps down on their bill. A strong, tightly rooted mollusk can hold the bird in place until the tide comes in. They also feed by carrying loose shellfish out of the water and hammering at the shell or by probing the sand for soft shell or razor clams. American oyster catchers breed between April and July. Their nests are shallow depressions scraped into the sand by an adult. Breeding adults will make five or more of these scrapes, then choose one to line with shells and pebbles. Although the eggs are well camouflaged, they are vulnerable to predation by raccoons, coyotes, skunks, gulls, crows, rats, and foxes. I just hope you liked this video, and we'll look for your next visit, pretty soon. Till then, take care and be safe.